Hey guys, it's me, Bullish Place here. As you guys can tell, um, there's quite a been a few changes. Obviously, if you look over there, the water is no longer glitched because Dak and Black Rose, the creator of this mod pack for Xbox One. Let's get this all this information out the way now. If you guys want to install Crazy Craft on Xbox One, please go check out Elder Wars of Gaming. He has a beautiful tutorial, step by step, how to do it, and check out Dak and Black Rose, the creator of this Crazy Craft mod pack for Xbox One for Bedrock Edition as well as Minecraft Pocket Edition. But basically, he updated it. Crazy craft and the first world, well, let's say it broke after I updated the the mod pack. Basically, I updated it, and a lot of stuff went wrong, and then I couldn't access the world. So I made a whole new world, copy and pasted the seed, basically rebuilt everything in creative, destroyed a lot of trees just to make my life a little easier. I tried my best to match whatever I had from the first world here. Honestly, I, I tried like I like I basically. Did everything in the first chest to make sure I have some supplies. But other than that, we're starting off from scratch. I do have, you know, whoops. I do have my iron armor and my diamond sword and pickaxe as well as my map. I do have, you know, Alex here. I don't know what the namer. Uh, when I get a name tag, hopefully you can put one on them. That could help out a lot. Sadly, in this mod pack update, I can no longer use staffs. They're glitched. And I believe they're coming up with an with a way to fix that pretty soon. But other than that, no more staffs. I think that's like a good thing because I did kind of kill Alex number one. Technically, if you want to be like on technical terms, this is Alex number three because Alex number two was left behind on the yeah in, in the first world that is no longer available because I can no longer access it. I broke it basically and I try to change mod packs and behavior packs and it was just yeah I, was, I broke it. That's all I'm gonna say. So there's a trader right here. Uh, what do you have? Ooh, you have like blue eyes, but yeah, welcome back to Crazy Craft with Bullish Plays. I believe, yeah, he, he updated a lot of things, which I do appreciate. I did spawn in a turtle who happened to be an adult, so yeah, still have my turtle, still have my house. I emptied out most of this area just to give me a little bit of room. I still have my potato, but basically, we're starting from scratch. I love how Alex still does not listen. Come on, follow me. The worst. I swear it's the worst. I feel like Alex is just one of those pets that like you like you tell them to stay, right? And they don't listen. I don't have my inventory pet, so I think we have a way to go. And by the way, uh, I'm still rocking the Founders Cape pack because I thought it would be kind of cool to rock it for a couple episodes. So goodbye to Trump Senior. You know, whoa, he did update it quite a bit actually. That was a weird death animation. But yeah, most of the mobs can drop stuff now. They, he put, gave them drop tables and I just got a diamond off of killing them. What the heck? I, I'm already enjoying the update. So I can basically live without, oh my. Oh my, this is, I don't, I'm not a big fan of the slaughter. But you know, it's still crazy craft. You still get a lot of cool things. I just had to update it because honestly the, the water glitch and the snow glitch Visually, it was just very uh, annoying for me. But today's episode is going to be focused on... Bro, I'm getting blessed. I'm going to accept this over the last mod pack. I'm going to say that right now. The, the drops are way better. Let me mine this. Get another diamond. Because I don't have to go mining. I can just kill mobs all day. We are going to do a few things in today's episode. Have this place lit up. Have a little fence to basically barricade me from these beautiful creatures that always harass me in every episode so far but this is episode three yeah there's a lot of things underwater and i'm definitely not in the mood to go down there so my goal is to have a little protection so basically like a fence around the house and a farm that is the main objective of today's episode uh it might be a little shorter than most but i just want to make sure i have a few things done plus i want to get an episode out as soon as possible i've been dragging this on too long as i was just messing around with updating crazy craft and trying to fix everything so i thought it was the best solution same seed same everything gave me some starting material so i gave, basically gave myself my diamond tools my first chest alex of course because i need alex so i'm gonna need an axe yeah kind of you know it's just unfortunate how things work out sometimes but it is a mod pack and i was not expecting everything to work but i will definitely take it At least I still got that mod going. So we're just going to clear out this area. And hopefully in the future, if he does update it, it doesn't uh, break this world. But if it does, then I probably have to do the same thing then. But I'm glad you guys are enjoying the series. I get a lot of comments actually on my prison series about when's the next episode and all that. So here we go. 
Honestly, I'm just going to be doing Crazy Craft and Lifeboat Prisons for now on. As I find it more enjoyable, I enjoy making the content for it, and you guys show the most feedback for it. So, you ask and you shall receive. I went to the last episode and made sure to grab what was in the first chest, for the most part. Other than that, like, that's like a starting kit, so. I didn't want to just build a house and just go from scratch to scratch, because I know that will be a little boring, in my opinion, to deal with uh, me just basically starting from scratch again. So I get myself a little bit of stuff from the last episode. We can stay consistent. What did he drop? Prismarine shard. I love the death effects. I'm not going to lie. So far, I have not seen a single dinosaur. So kind of kind of worried about that. I got a piston. These these deaths are kind of funny. I do need food. So I'm just going around. Yeah, not everything's going to drop an item, sadly. But for the most part, I'll take it. He dropped a lead. That's kind of cool. I have yet to see a dinosaur, so I'm kind of afraid, like, if you took them out or the mod pack didn't, like, download properly, because I thought it still had dinosaurs. Well, guys, but this is the most recent version of Crazy Craft by Dakin Black Rose. What the hell? Is that his soul? Here, dude, I'll let you be free. Here, here, man. Looks like you're just trying to be free, bro. I hope you try to be free. There, is, is that helping? I'm not a big fan of that. You know, here, maybe I'll just destroy this. There, man, be free. Ah, ghost piggy. Bro, you really gave him these death anim- Ow, what the- Oh, you hit me. Dude, I'm, I'm enjoying the drops a lot more. I really need food. I need food. Hopefully, no dinosaurs won't be a big deal as, uh, I'm, I'm really trying my best- Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. There is still going to be glitches here and there because it is a mod pack after all. I'm going to keep going out and hunting for food. Might as well. I hope you guys do not mind the me updating the world every so often to make sure I have the most recent Crazy Craft version. As I want to make sure it's just up to date and all the glitches are gone and all that good stuff. And honestly... I really wanted this update because I wanted the water to be fixed as I didn't want to have it being a visual, visually impairing myself because I was having a tough time playing on this mod pack because of the water being glitched in the snow. Because I'm, you guys know, I do wear glasses because on Bullish Cloud 5, my main channel, I do stream with face cam. I'm not sure if you guys want face cam in these videos. If you do, just let me know and I'll gladly start adding that to my videos as I want to make sure they're the most entertaining as possible. Dude, we got an emerald from him. I'm just going around slaying out these mobs because they're dropping stuff and I'm enjoying it a lot more. And another diamond. Whoa! Okay, guys, so I had to wait till the ambient sound, aka dogs barking outside, went down because I did find something. But why is there a killer well on land? Oh my god, you do damage. You do what? This ain't fair. You're on land. Aha. Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. That can, um, we, we got a problem. I, I know there's land sharks and all, but land killer wells? Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Nope, we're not having the, the death counter going up anymore. Come on, health. Come on, health. Get in the water. Oh, one health. You know what? I'm just gonna go back in. But there is, there's, there's skeletons over there, skeleton horses, and I really want to get one because the horses you don't need a saddle, and I think they'll be really clutch. But we're gonna wait till I regenerate health real fast. I mean, a meme pine. Like, look at this. Going around killing mobs are just, it's a lot more fun. I got three diamonds out of it. Got prismarine out of it. Just a lot of cool drops. A lead, a piston. Okay, I think I have enough time to go. I don't need their hair no more. I need to despawn. <gasps> nope, they're there. Oh my god, there's too many of them though. Okay, I can make this work. I can make this work. I know I can make this work. No, I can't make this work. I'm getting gunned. I'm getting straight arrowed. You have aimbot, bro. Got you off. Okay, they're fighting with each other. That's good. Okay, I think these are all mine now. 
Nice! I got skeleton horses for days! Nice. I'm I'm proud owner of a skeleton horse. Um, I guess for now, I guess you guys can just live with me. Nope, never mind. Um, okay, um. Hmm. We gotta we gotta do something here. Alright, so thanks. For now, it's temporary. No, it's not really good housing conditions for them. But I really want to keep these skeleton horses. I know in today's episode I wanted to work on a few things. I'm still gonna get there. It's just uh, you know, skeleton horses, man. They're they're unique. I'm gonna go get more. It's still raining, so the mobs are gonna be okay, good. There we go. Killer whale's gone. Said nope, it's not. It's just lurking. It's lurking. Jump bullish. It was just lurking the whole time. Hey there, sheep's just gonna say hi. Oh wow, one shot. One shot. I feel bad when I do this. They die bald. Only get two of them out of there. Oh wait, nope, they're just running around being careless. Hey buddies. Uh where's your amigos at? Pretty sure. Okay, there's one here. You have the most health, so I like you. Um, I'm gonna try to save you as well. But I'm gonna get this horse. We're gonna start a farm and finish the uh, the fencing. And then we're gonna call today an episode. I know it's gonna be like a little short one. We have quite a few skeleton horses, which is great. Just need to build a fence now. And I have plenty of wood to do so. So we're gonna build it out of you know out of oak for now. Although I could do cobble. Hmm. I think cobble will be nice, but so then we have quite a few goodies. I'm debating on how to do this fence. Like how you did a little glitch. So I'm debating on whether I should do a fancy fence or no well, for the most part. I do want to build an external wall that wraps around this whole entire island. This is why I wanted the island in the first place. Because I can, you know, shield myself from the horrible horrible beings out there give me something here yeah, give me emerald give me a diamond please i'll take that that was quartz what are you gonna drop me leather oh my can you get up <gasps> you dropped the diamond i need that yep i will definitely dive into this scary scary abyss for some damn diamond all right so what i'm gonna do i'm probably just gonna build a small fence in front of my house just so i can have that little protection and probably a little yeah i'm gonna build a fence over here just give myself a little bit of protection and then build a little fence over here for him. And these guys are going to be in the pit for a while until I build a barn next episode. But we are making progress. Here, you guys can get a little bit of protection too. This is super, super ghetto. Uh, then Alex can actually go outside for once and enjoy life. Hope she doesn't die. That would be quite embarrassing. Alex can just, you know, just, you know, be, be good now. She can just walk in and out. Be happy with their life. So we have the fence going, which is great. The mine, I'm debating. It's still going to be over here, I believe. I think this might be a good area for the mine. Oh. Yeah, it goes. Follow me. Yeah, I'm going to put the mine over there. So I'm going to make a diamond shovel. I mean, I have diamonds now. I can build stuff from it. I'm going to build this way down. So I eventually want to make a special, I eventually want to make a water tunnel down, which would be kind of cool. You know what, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna make sure not to crouch. I remember this area. But you guys eventually see what I'm gonna put here though. So that's, that's the beauty about it. Did I at least bring coal with me? No, I did not, but okay, I think that's enough. So I want to get my turtle out of uh, those living conditions of living inside a bunch of logs. We got to rescue my turtle and I need to get name tags. So hopefully one of these mobs will eventually drop a name tag for me. But you'll see exactly what... Alex? Okay, you're in here. Good, good, good. Totally wasn't worried about my Minecraft girlfriend. Boom. So this is plenty enough. Alrighty, we got my turtle. Hey, buddy. How are you? Let me be free now. And the last thing we need to work on is our farm. And that's today's episode. I know it's not the greatest entertaining one. Get down. Get down. No. <laughs> Don't need to lose my turtle over this. It's not the most entertaining episode. But honestly, it's just I needed to get this out here. As soon as possible, explain to what happened to the first world. As I did label this world Crazy Craft 2. Like, I'm being serious. Crazy Craft 2. Because the first world died. Because I updated the game. And you guys can tell a lot of things have changed and I do like it. 
unfortunately a few of my favorite things are gone but hopefully in the future that can uh fixes it i know it's just probably this glitch just because it's a mod pack so there's gonna be a lot of issues especially since it's on xbox one and he's trying to make all this work you know what i don't need you can escape you know I'm, I'm not even worried about that i have yet to seen you you look like a underwater mob but i wasn't you didn't really put up a big fight take you i've I think he took out inventory pets because I have yet to find one. I probably got to craft them now. I want to make sure I have plenty of space for a farm. And honestly, I might just make this into the farm area for now. And then we're going to go get our seeds that I should have plenty of. Kind of. Not really. I did save my one potato. Let's get the bones. Okay, we have plenty of bones so we can make bone meal to get stuff really going. By the way, in the comment section down below, go ahead and leave suggestions on what I should do in the next video. Obviously, I need to clean up my area a little bit more. As I do want project suggestions, so I know what to do in every episode to keep you guys entertained. Yeah, right now I'm just gathering resources as if, like, I'm still in the very beginning stages of Minecraft. Where you got to make sure you have enough materials. I have the house. I hate these spiders. Don't miss you guys. Definitely do not miss them at all, and I want to leave this area as soon as possible because those spiders are absolutely disgusting hideous gross the worst thing ever in the mod pack you disgust me hole oh, you have an army you got a little army with you no come here come to the line come to the line this is not fair to 3v1 but you know i'm just gonna mode do you guys because you know i'm goaded goaded you also call me the the goaty goaty, not diamond goat. That's a reference to my lifeboat series. If you guys want to watch that, my lifeboat prisons. It's a lot of fun. Recommend you guys checking it out. On my grade, I'm on my road to grade Z. Okay, take that. Drop me a diamond. You be goaded. We just had a little fight underwater. Don't like that at all. All right, guys. This should wrap up today's episode. Like I said, I apologize. It's not the longest episode, but hope you guys did enjoy. Drop a like. Subscribe if you are brand new. Hit those post notifications so you guys know whenever I do upload or stream. And most importantly, comment your favorite part of the video and your thoughts on me updating Crazy Craft. Are you guys cool with it? Or do you guys want me to download the old version and just play on that one since it had dinosaurs? It's all up to you. I want to make sure you guys are entertained. I don't mind. I just prefer this one because the water is much nicer and I figured it would be much easier on your guys' eyes when you watch because the water was a little glitchy. But I was mainly because of the prehistoric pack, so I'm not sure if he just took out the prehistoric pack. So it can be just much smoother. And honestly, I don't feel as laggy anymore when playing Crazy Craft. Because usually I lagged. If you guys saw in the last episode, I died because of lag. Besides that, come here, Alex. Have a good one. I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Crazy Craft with Bullish Plays.